Today we're going to talk about machine health. Derek Riggs is with me today. Why do I care about machine health? So when it comes to machine health, we're really focused on those proactive solutions for our customers. The most important thing to note is that we need a telematics connection to the machine in order to receive those fault codes that are coming off equipment. From there, we have a team of six of us here at RDO when it comes to machine health. We take in those fault codes, have a triage tool that we use, and target those sickest machines first. So when I talk sickest machines, we're looking at oil pressure fault codes, coolant pressure, those higher priority fault codes where maybe a machine is gonna derate. And our main thing is to catch those machines before they go down, eliminate that downtime too as well. So about how many machines do you monitor? So we monitor roughly 18,000 machines here at RDO. 18,000. Yeah, that's quite the number for sure, but it's impressive what we can do with technology and having that triage tool and targeting those sick machines. You're monitoring 18,000 machines, so what's the process to get the machine monitored by your group? So this year we've included machine health monitoring in our RDO promise. We felt the value of being proactive and we're really looking forward to monitoring more pieces of equipment and making sure we're partnering with our customers, increasing that machine uptime. That is great. So RDO Promise, it is an uptime guarantee that includes remote machine monitoring and these guys watching over your machine at a high level. Absolutely. We're excited. Yeah, your 18,000 is going up, buddy. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> so we work with our field teams a lot of the time because they know our customers and the contacts the best. There are those cases where there's an oil pressure code that we reach out to the operator, get that machine shut down right away. We do have what are called expert alerts that are John Deere exclusive. Those are alerts that are proactive and data driven from John Deere. And when we trigger an expert alert on a specific piece of equipment, we're 95% confident that we have the solution before we even visit the machine. Wow. Wow. So if it's an expert alert and it says you need to bring a turbo, you know, just throw the turbo in the truck, take it with you because you know you're going to need it. Absolutely. That's part of our proactive approach versus the reactive that we're used to. We want to show up with the parts in hand, eliminate extra travel to the machine and eliminate downtime and schedule the repair when it's convenient for the customer. I mean, do you have any examples where you saved a machine or some component of a machine that you feel really good about? Yeah, I always go back to a 944K that we had. In this case, the 944K triggered uh, engine oil pressure, extremely low expert alert. And with that expert alert, we knew there was three potential issues. One, the oil pump failed. Two, the crossover tube was cracked. Or three, the pickup tube was cracked. So what we did was get a loaner out to that customer, brought the machine back to the shop, and on the 944, you have to pull the engine to get the oil pan off. So went through that process, ended up getting the pan off. And when we pulled the oil pump off, the check ball that seats in the oil pump was twisted just a little bit. And that was causing the low oil pressure that we can see from the data in the background. 944 is a high performance machine. It's a very high production machine. So it would have cost this customer a lot of money when it went down. I mean, probably would have still been covered under warranty, but he'd have been down for who knows how long and inconvenienced. and. That's a big win for him. Absolutely. And we have wins like that on the machine health on a daily basis. Maybe not to that level, but there's quite a few of them. We just target that repair and make it work for the customer when it's convenient for them. Like you said, we all have those short windows to get work done. Proactively, we've saved roughly 50 engines here at RDO in the last year. Oh, so. wow. That is very cool. How else can you help me save money, make money, be more efficient? We're always open to questions, but um, uh, when it comes to expert alerts, fault codes on your equipment, you can reach out to the machine health team. Also, we can do some remote programming over the air when it comes to software to change some parameters that are maybe causing a few minor codes on your equipment too. And you can do this on John Deere, Ag Construction, Vermeer, pretty much anything we sell, you can help at some level. At some level, yeah, yeah. and that's yeah. our goal. We really wanna be a leader when it comes to proactive alert management at RDO. All right, well, thank you very much. Thank you, appreciate yeah. it, Dennis. Yeah. Hey, I'm Dennis Howard. I hope you enjoyed that video. Please like and subscribe and follow us on social media. See you soon. Supervisor of Machine Health Monitoring. Nope, what is your title again? <laughs> that would work. So. <laughs> I'm gonna stop there. What did we forget? I feel like I stumbled a little bit. No. No. I'm just gonna stop a little bit.